Hey everybody, how's it going? Today I got a new suspension system for you. I'm calling it the soft buckle suspension system. Here it is on black Dyneema webbing uh, connected to the tree via a soft link. And what I have here is a Prusik with a loop through it and the blue Prusik part one sec, sorry about that. The blue Prusik part instantly connects to my hammock via this button knot. So I just go through the loop here and then I go over the knot just like in my other videos. I'm going through the loop, I'm going over the knot. And it creates an instant connection. Then my buckle system, this is actually, I've been hanging in this for about an hour now. And I had to unwrap some of the prusiks because I could not move it on the line. But you adjust it by pulling on this loop. You hold your strap and pull the loop to adjust the length. So I'm going to, uh, I'm actually going to step on this line since I got my uh, other, so I'm adjusting this. And now I'm just going to get in it, get in the hammock, show you guys how it works. All right, here we go. Moment of truth. So that's a four wrap Prusik on the Dyneema line. So here I am all the way in my hammock. No slippage. I didn't even have to dress the Prusik. All the way in my hammock. Fireman's pond and some ducks. I've been messing around with this hammock for about an hour and have not got the got it to slip. I've actually had to undo some of the prusiks because it gets so tight that it's kind of hard to adjust. But the loop, the little loop that goes through there does make it easy to adjust because you can when you pull on that loop it opens up the prusik a little bit. So I'll hop out and show you. So when you adjust this, the Prusik kind of bites down and I might even go one less, less Prusik and test it, maybe try sleeping in it once. But so far this is working great. I've bounced in the hammock a bunch. I've got it. I've got a pretty steep hang angle so I've got extra tension on it. And uh, see right now I'm stepping on the rope and it's kind of hard to adjust still. So I might have to do something different with this, but it works pretty damn good. And on the other side, I just have some daisy chain straps. And here I have the Evo loop, which is just what I'm calling the continuous loops that I make. But I'm using the button knot to connect the lines together. So here's another way that the button knot acts like an instant carabiner. I just feed the loop. I just feed it through the sewn in loop and then back through the two strands and push it up tight and the two strands lock that big knot in, in place and also the tension on the strap kind of helps hold these two strands together and this this is totally reliable I mean obviously there isn't a lock right here like a full-on carabiner but I'm about 220 pounds I have every confidence in that I can get in here and uh, bounce around, act like a jackass, and uh, no problems. Thanks, guys.